So I'm really excited this morning to be packing up uh, one of my best necklaces ever, this watermelon tourmaline with a sterling silver uh, tab. It's a little slightly adjustable. It's delicate and beautiful. And it's bought <laughs> by a dear friend of mine who is actually one of my bridesmaids. And I thought I want to do something special. So I wanted to show her how I was packing it up for her. When you buy a Zen Mooney design, I always send some affirmation cards that you can keep with you and, of course, the requisite business card. So those are going to go in. And extra stickers. Um, I don't always do this with my earrings, but I definitely do with a beautiful necklace like this one. And, of course, a free cleaning pad. So those are going to go in the box here. But one of my favorite things about my necklaces, they look kind of too big on my earring boxes, but I love to use my imprinter. My daughter bought me with them. Um, the Zen Mundi, this one's kind of off center. So the trick is to get it lined up in here. Um, whoops, that one is has something on it. And get it lined up just right so it's centered and then push down so hard to get the imprint looking wonderful to decorate the box with. See? So there it is, the Enlightened World of Zen Mundi Designs. Whoops, there it is. Um, and then, so that's ready to go. And then you're guessing the next part. Uh, necklace goes in this, I what you call these, organza bag, carefully, on top of the freebie gifts. Uh, whoops, gently put in there. I'm sure by the time it goes through the post, it won't open and look like I have it in, but hmm, that's the way it goes, I guess. They're uh, all my items I send to be sure that the mail doesn't crash them around too much. With stones, it's a little bit easier but sometimes you don't know and then I'm going to um, add this with a wonderful raffia ribbon and because I am not really great at tying these ribbons I don't think I'm gonna video myself struggling but I'll eventually post a picture of what the box looks like it, when it's done if you buy earrings you just get them in a nice craft box sometimes I add a sticker sometimes not if it's oceany like these um, humpback whale earrings I'll probably maybe add a sticker to the box or maybe not because it looks nicer sometimes without so Susan this one's for you I appreciate it and I'm going to have a lot of uh, happiness knowing that you're going to be wearing something I made that was one of my very favorite creations so thank you